the first memories I got about cars, it was with my dad when I was young. I was like nine, ten years old, you know, like my dad had a mechanic shop. He used to race and he used to build race cars. I kind of grew up in a, in a shop with him. I am Coco Surida and I drive a 2012 Nissan GTR. I've been riding for about 20 years now and I've accomplished a bunch of things. Honestly, I'm so thankful. Basically, my, my, my biggest accomplishment is just being able to live off BMX, you know? Other than that, I'm just, I'm just, uh, I can't really ask for much more, right? Everything else on top of that is just a gift from God. But I was able to, to land the first triple tail whip on my discipline, which is vert. Triple tail whip is like a triple spin on the bike going high in a big ramp, pretty scary, and that kind of put my name in the map. So when I first moved to the States, I was 19 years old. I came to Dallas, Texas to work with some friends as a salesman. We used to sell water filters. After that, I started riding bikes in shows, doing bike shows, and that's how I started building my career as a pro rider and that was the whole purpose of my trip to make my dream a reality first time i saw a gtr was when i went to japan i saw these r34s and i was mind blown it was a beautiful beautiful car seeing it in person was like a myth you know it was insane it was just so incredible so right now my tires and wheel setups I'm running the T37s on the front, 11 wide by 20, and in the back there are 12 by 20. We're using Nitos NT01 tires. We installed a full uh, Rocket Bunny wide body kit. It's called Pandem, which is the newest version. As far as suspension goes, we're working with KW full coilovers all around. Also, we got the control arms and sway bars from Wideline. Performance-wise, we changed all the intakes and intercooler pipes, including the inner cooler. The, the car was built and tuned at Road Ridge Engineering. We're using uh, Ecutech uh, engine management. My friend Rick out, out at Road Race was in charge of tuning the car. The car is about 700 horsepower. We also delete the front wheel drive. So the car is a rear wheel drive GTR, which there's not very many in the States. GTR. We went into the computer, we adjusted all the sensors and settings, we disconnected the front shaft and that was it. There's a lot of connection between riding BMX and driving cars and being a car enthusiast. There's always uh, some sort of evolution in whatever we do, you know, always want to go faster, always going to go higher, always want to do a crazier jump, that's kind of in our DNA. And in, kind of in the car industry, it's kind of the same thing. You're always looking to make your car faster. You're always looking to make your car look cooler and improve new things. And, and I like that a lot, especially when you get a lot of power, you get the adrenaline rush, and, and that kind of, I can relate that to BMX a lot. Hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that short film because we had a blast filming that with Coco. So if you guys want to follow Coco Zarita, I'm going to put his Instagram and his YouTube channel in the description down below. And I also want to give a big shout out to the shop called RRE located in California out here in Santa Fe Springs, which actually made this happen. If you guys have uh, any car that needs some tuning, go hit up RRE, which is uh, known as Road Racing Engineering out in Santa Fe Springs in California. Um, I'll put their info in the description down below as well. And they actually tuned our, our Evo, my cousin's Evo 9 and it, they, they're, they're tuning as flawless. So now the next thing I want to talk about for the OG subscribers and our new subscribers, 
Um, I wanted to give you guys a heads up. I haven't, I don't think I have a really done an official video. I've done some Instagram stuff of our new online store. And I've mentioned that every here and every once in a while, but I haven't really showed our merchandise. So on our online store, we have some key tags. If you guys want to pick them up, we have some cardboard key tags. And uh, we just picked up some decals too. So if you guys want to pick up some, uh, some decals for your car, we have these. And these have been doing really well. And these, uh, we started selling Broadway mirrors too, which are pretty cool. I have them in all my cars and it, it, we've been having trouble trying to keep this in stock. So if you guys want to go ahead and pick that up, just go to our online store at carsonboardchannel.com and I'll put the info for that in the description down below. Please hit the like button. I know it's a hassle to hit the like button, but uh, it really helps us out to rank our videos a little higher. And uh, by ranking up us higher, it gives us more potential to do this full time, which we want to do. So don't forget to hit that like button. I love you guys, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.